Welcome to Computer Tech TV. I am Rick Arter. Today I'd like to talk to you about the new Intel Sandy Bridge E CPUs that will be coming out to the market soon. I'd like to go over some information about the first three processors that will be released as well as the actual release dates that were leaked onto several websites lately. The expected release date for the first set of Intel Sandy Bridge E CPUs will be quarter four of 2011 which hopefully will be around early October. They'll be based on the Socket 2011, which is based on the X79 chipset, which is codenamed Patsburg. They'll feature quad-channel memory support, PCI Express 3.0 compatibility, and have multiple X16 PCI Express lanes, which will be available on the X79 motherboards. The first three CPUs that will come out on the new 2011 socket under the Sandy Bridge E name will be the Core i7-3820, which will feature a locked multiplier the Core i7-3930K, which will feature an unlocked multiplier, and the Core i7-3960X, which will be the highest-end unlocked Extreme Edition processor. The Core i7-3820 will fall under the Performance P1 segment and feature four cores with eight threads. The clock speed will come in at 3.6 GHz, while turbo boost speed will be 3.8 GHz. The CPU will feature 10 megabytes of L3 cache and be available for roughly around $400 US. The Core i7-3930K will fall under the Performance P2 segment, have 6 cores with 12 threads, feature a clock speed of 3.2 GHz with a turbo speed of 3.8 GHz, have 12 megabytes of L3 cache, and will be available for roughly $560 US dollars. The Core i7-3960X will fall under the Extreme Edition category and it will be the flagship model for Intel when these first three processors are released at the end of 2011. It will feature 6 cores, 12 threads, have a clock speed of 3.33 GHz with a turbo boost speed of 3.9 GHz. CPU will feature 15 MB of L3 cache and it will go in the price range of roughly $1,000 US dollars. The 3960X will not hold the title forever since the second half of 2012 it is going to be replaced according to some leaked sources by the faster i7-3980X Extreme Edition CPU. Now this processor will feature 8 cores and it will be the first consumer octa-core Intel CPU to be released to the public. The clocks will fall under the following frequencies 3.4 to 3.5 gigahertz and turbo speeds up to 4 GHz to 4.1 GHz. That concludes this video on the new Sandy Bridge eCPUs coming to the market soon from Intel. If you guys would like to see more, please check the description box where I'll have the links to this information. And thanks a lot for watching, everyone. More videos to come.